Quid pro quo brute here. We are checking out the Wasteland Defense, so let's read the setup. Uh, welcome to Wasteland Defense. Requires uh, script, extend, script extender. Excuse me. Before constructing the fort, you're going to need this water tank. Water tank is in your aid. Construct the water tank where you want this place to be. So, cool deal. We are uh, we're with Niner and um, Champ. Champ of Hellhound and Boone. Uh, we're wearing these um, armors. I was doing saving Car uh, Carla Boone mod, but that's just the worst mod ever. Yeah, it's terrible right now. Um, it, it's it's like an alpha stage, and I didn't know that when I downloaded it. So I basically played for three hours, had three hours worth of videos, and they were just crap. So I decided to start something new. Um, we're going to do Wasteland Defense. I don't know a great place to do this. Um, one person suggested this dry lake. Someone suggested the dry lake um, south of Prim. So my guess is you need a lot of open area. So let's... let's. I guess we have to clear this place out first would be a good idea. And do I have any weapons? Oh, yes, we also have this Desert Eagle 7. That's right. This was also another gun that I was going to review whatever so we're gonna start this and then I think eventually I'll just add weapons um, so we'll go through different weapons but first I guess we need to clear out this place to set up wasteland defense I really like this gun I really like the armor that these guys have Niner has a type 7 I think it's Chinese and he has the woodland and I have the desert camo of course I will find the name of it and I'll I'll let you guys know what it is next time we need to kill these goddamn ants, though, so we can set up this place. Oh, God. That one was dead, and it was scaring me still. Okay, so that is nothing useful. Uh, I don't like, like, the haze type thing kind of here. Get out of... All right, whatever. So we're going to start here. I have no idea how to play this at all. I had a hard time, hard time with real-time settlers. So I'm sure I'm going to have even more a hard time with this. Alright, manipulate. I need to pay attention, so left, right button, rotate and zoom. Okay, X, X, Y, Z, E. Alright. So this, this isn't, be, it doesn't matter where I put this, I guess. Good. Water tank is used as the center of your fort when structuring objects. You must remain within the boundaries of your fort. Your fort is still small and you can't support widespread construction yet. Once your fort begins to grow, it will begin easier to make farther away from the water tank. Now that you have constructed the location, it's time to construct the essentials. Having storage for any of your supplies you may come across as a necessity. Supplies you come across can be used to upgrade your fort in various ways. The plans for the supply storage have been added to your inventory. Alright. Is this a quest? Do I get a quest so I know where to go? Cause I'm an idiot. Yeah, construct a storage thingy. I don't know how to do that. I guess I go this way. Nope. All right, there we go. If you haven't experienced any crashes, report them in the proper debug reset. All right, this is just a message. I don't know why it showed up now, but it did. All right, so I need to look at my notes. I guess. Maybe. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's from an old mod. Were you guys paying attention? There we go. Um, yes, that's where I want it. Um, X, Y, and Z should be doing shit, right? I guess it doesn't really matter where I put it. I mean, I'm sure it does. You guys will probably call me an idiot for not knowing. I'm having trouble with X, Y, and Z, so I don't know if I don't have New Vegas script extender correct in here or what the sitch is. Um, yeah, I'm gonna spend a lot of time with this. Like, God damn it, Niner. Whatever. That's where I wanted it, anyways. Alright, supplies are looted off enemies you defeat during sieges. You can access your supplies via the storage supply. Your plans for the fort headquarters have been added to your inventory. Give you a place to manage your fort and plan out your defenses. All can provide a place to rest and recover, and the future can be upgraded and expanded. Alright. 
let's uh, let's let's plans for HQ. Alrighty, back the hell away. Okay, that's rotating it. It's just right up in my face, and I don't like that, and I don't know how to fix that. But I don't know. That's fine, I guess. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, great. There's no way to get inside. Some buildings you struck me require a second object. In this case, the plans for the door. Plans for the door. Alright, good. This is walking me through it. Because otherwise, I'd have no idea what I'm doing. There we go. Create, creating object. Um. Yeah, I totally effed that one up, didn't I? Set up. Before it's beginning to grow, and soon it will begin to draw the attention of the various factions. Not all these factions will be friendly, therefore it would be a good idea to recruit some guards. The barracks allow you to recruit guards and patrol the fort to keep it safe. Good. Um, yeah, I, I, I messed up. I think I messed up the door somehow. Whatever. Let's build some barracks. Oh, these... Those those are not barracks. I don't know who told these people these were barracks. These these are not barracks. <laughs> All right, the barracks allow you to recruit guards for your fort. You don't need very many guards, but a good idea to have some form of protection. This guy's really not causing any problems, but I really like that guy. All right, let's recruit one. Activate barracks. Oh God, food count thirty, number of guards zero twenty five. You must have at least 10 food to support a new guard. Patrol foods will automatically move around your fort. Stationary guards are added to your inventory and placed just like any other. I don't know if I have all of them. I said I need a patrol, right? Let's, uh, let, let's get some caps while we're at it. Player.add item 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 F. And let's get. 100,000. Why not? That is the only console, like, ad item that I know by memory. Alright, set up. Guard patrol the perimeter of the fort to ensure its safety. However, your fort's boundaries have not been defined. Illustrate the limits. This is represented by the fort. Uh, on the outskirts of fort. It's just that you are spread apart. Guards will patrol between these points to be sure to cover as much ground. Required to be placed a certain distance from the water after you... All right, that's confusing. There's, there he is. Howdy. Howdy. He's a cool guy. Okay. Um, were these supposed to turn green or something? I don't know how far apart these need to be. Oh, you know what? I figured out how to move things to and fro. However, however, um, yeah, let's come on. Let's let's get out of my work area. There we go. For some reason, I can't post this. Am I not? Am I too close or not close enough? Um, am I not? Oh, you have to press X, Y, and Z, and then use the buttons, the mouse one and mouse two. All right, that makes sense now. Okay, so placing, placing, pl placing. It's red. It's supposed to be green. Is it green yet? I can't. I can only tell right now. There we go. Now it's far enough away, but I want to rotate it. This land is my land. That's basically what that note's saying. Alright, let's go to map B, I guess. I guess make this. We're gonna make this squarish. 
That would make sense, right? I don't know. That should be far enough away. That's a big freaking land space. I don't know. Can you do this anywhere else? Like, is this even possible to play much of anywhere else? Is it green now? Yeah, it's green. All right, hopefully they'll stay off my lawn. Uh, map marker C. I'm gonna get brutally murdered, I can just tell. I don't know what you're protecting, are you just trying to survive with this? Like, I didn't read this at all, so you guys are just gonna make fun of me when I play, which is okay. There's Helios 1, um, hopefully I'm not too close, otherwise bad things might happen or something. Doesn't look green to me. Looks doesn't look red though either. So it's red. It's for sure red. And there we go. Yes, they have to be facing out. That's that's correct. All right, let's let's do this. Do do do. Good job, Niner. Ah, so saving Carla Boone, that's why we have um, Craig Boone. But, uh, I don't know. I, I had some opinions about that mod. <laughs> Basically that it was kind of presented as done when should not have been. Patrol guards will obviously keep watch your fort. However, they do require some time other day to rest and relax. Unessential items may help with that. You can purchase these unessential items from the market. Construct a market, right? That's what I need to do. Um, I saw a video maybe a year ago. It had to be a year ago. About the real-time strat uh, RTS one. And that one looked a lot funner. To, not funner. More fun to me. Um... I don't know how beneficial this is going to be, this strategy of my buildings, but this is how they're being, oh god, that's going to suck. Okay, uh, unessential items such as bed rolls, wooden pallets, and stairs, restocks every three days, however, you grab various rare plants you can come across, check back every two or three days. Establish the basis, familiarize yourself with the player menu and the raid system. You have been access to the player menu system. This can be brought up by the H button. So I can get through there. So that champ can't. I hope that's going to be okay. Um, hey, what can I get for you? I'd like some construction plans. Oh, cool. It's um, junk wall. All right. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Oh wow. Goodbye. So that's kind of cool. All right, we're supposed to do something. Not this. We're supposed to uh, press nope. Press C to stop, not E, not activate button. We're supposed to press H. Remotely access the raid system. Let's cheat debug options. Click the start raid button to access the raid system. Cheat. Cheat. Change raid settings. Continue. Uh, start raid. Raid system. Start a raid on your fort. You may select the type of enemy via the raid menu. Once a raid is started, you will have timed preparation before the raid starts. Your fort does not yet have an alarm system. Great. Um, I can select any of these guys, but fiends, I guess, are weakest. Survive your first raid. That's cute. That's cute. I'll take that. It has no worth to me. Um, so I guess they could be from anywhere, but this guy is... He 
yeah, he's he's hightailing it out of here. All right, so that's not a sniper rifle. That is a sidearm, but I like it. So one person attacked. That doesn't seem like a raid. I guess they could potentially kill my guard, right? That'd be bad. I don't want that to happen. I really like the gun. Uh, you've successfully completed the first raid. Take the time to scavenge the dead raiders' bodies. They might have equipment or stuff. With your first search, your fort has merged into the wasteland as a potential target for many years. As your fort continues to grow, these enemies will grow brave and attack your fort without any warning or proclamation. It'd be wise to keep bolstering your defense and keep your guns to Okay. Now that your fort has been enabled, you can enable the random raid feature by using the terminal in your fort HQ. Once you have enabled the raid, you can change the frequency. Uh, loot. Nothing good here. Alright. Fort quest added. Oh, Jesus. So this is a pretty good mod so far. This is going to be more than one parts. I don't know how many parts this is going to be. I don't know when I started recording, so I don't know how long this first part's going to be. I know I need to go into... Well, it says here. He was ducking for... Why does his hair change? He was bald earlier. I'm looking for a power source. I'm looking for an easier way. I'm looking for assistance. Um, that one? Never mind, I'll be going. Search Helios 1. Uh, we're going inside here, though. Railroad bill. Railroad bill. Hmm. I know we have several quests going on here. I don't know. That's confusing the hell out of me. Part 1. No. Part 2. Part 3. Part 4. Okay. So we have to do all four parts, I guess. What can I get for you? Guard stronger. I wish I could just go back in. Um, easier way to scavenge equipment. Look around the Mojave outpost for a semi truck. Uh, I need to get going. Let's talk to him one more time. What can I get for you? Assistance during raids. Communications array. I hear the Black Mountain Station. Um, and what's the last one? Way to maintain the health of my guards. Old Mormon Fort. Alright, great. Cool. So this is the start of my Wasteland Defense series. This is part one. Uh, pretty good so far. Um, I don't know what I'm doing at all. <laughs> so I'm going to be looking at the comments for your suggestions on what to do, how to do this, what I should do, if I should have companions... If I need to get my weapons. I didn't think I could leave. Like, I thought I read I couldn't leave my fort. Maybe that was doing raids. I I don't know. So, um, thanks guys for watching this one. I will see you guys soon. Make sure you uh, like this video and you uh, stay tuned for the next set.